morning, good morning. It's lunchtime. Had a rough little morning. I had a rough morning. Yeah. <laughs> Not everybody else. I had a rough little morning. Because you had a rough night. Yeah, I didn't really sleep much last night. And then I woke up in a little bit of pain this morning. So I did not pick up the camera because I was barely getting myself ready to do homeschool. So I definitely did not have the energy to pick up the camera and talk to you guys. But good morning. I'm here. I'm here. Not to worry. Uh, still in pain, but I'm pushing through because I have no choice, you know. Or I don't have a choice. That sounded like terrible English. All right, so it is lunchtime. We are having grilled cheese and soup. Um, that's easy peasy and delicious. Hope you guys are all having a wonderful day. Yeah. <laughs> so our lunch menu is planned out at the beginning of the month. I don't mess around with that. I got enough stuff going on with homeschool. We'll be trying to figure out what we're going to eat every single day. So in the beginning of the month, I planned that out and we have a whole menu ready to go for lunch. Dinner, on the other hand, is kind of whatever my wife pulls out the freezer. But uh, lunch is secured <laughs> for the month. And today's. Um, lunch menu with soup fruit and grilled cheese so that's what we're gonna have the kids are washing their hands and getting ready for lunch and we're in here making plates so i just wanted to open up the vlog get it ready for the day since i was struggling a little bit this morning but today we are definitely i'm gonna put y'all in the calendar i was about to say i'm gonna put y'all in the calendar <laughs> i told y'all i was struggling apparently more than i thought I'm going to put y'all in the cabinet so I can be hands-free so I can serve some lunch plates here. Or cut up some grilled cheese. That's really what I'm about to do. So. Do you need the fire? Because I can cut the No, you can cut that fire off. I mean, I am going to need to make another grilled cheese, but you can cut that off. All right. So, yeah. Today's plans are to put the, the tree upstairs up <laughs> and then get it decorated for sure. Um. I was waiting to do that because, like I said yesterday, uh, it was Anaya's dad's night, so she wasn't here. And I definitely wanted to wait for her to do the tree. She's super excited about doing the tree, and so I didn't want to do that without her. And honestly, she's a lot of help. <laughs> Anaya can have a hole. This is the boys. So, yeah. Um, so, we're going to get that done today because she's here with us for the rest of the week. And... Um, we're going to be able to decorate the tree today. Maybe put up some more decorations around the house because I still have a pile right over my shoulder. That is a pile of Christmas decorations. I'm just not sure where I'm going to put them yet. Um, I do have some decorations going upstairs. But y'all can go sit down. Um, but it's not like the house isn't like fully decorated. I'm feeling like it could be a little bit more Christmassy. This is my favorite holiday and it doesn't, it feels Christmassy in here, but maybe because we don't have the trees decorated, but it doesn't feel like super Christmassy like I want it to. So <sighs> I'm going to put some more decorations up and then for sure, for sure this weekend we are going to go out and buy some more decorations to kind of just fill in the spots that I am missing. And then also to get some more decorations for the new Christmas tree. So we got uh, some shopping trips to take you on this weekend to kind of get that wrapped up. Christmas is coming, y'all. Whether you're ready or not, here it comes. Uh, I feel like every day it's like I get a little bit more anxiety because I don't feel like I'm ready. I'm like not in the Christmas spirit. I want to be. My house doesn't feel in the Christmas spirit yet. I don't know. I can't really explain it, but I'm going to change it because I'm excited about Christmas and I'm, it's our first Christmas in this house. So I want to make sure it's super special, but I feel like I'm like running behind in time if that, if you know what I mean. So anywho, welcome to the vlog. Welcome to Vlogmas. We're going to go ahead and eat our lunch and check in with you guys a little later. Bye. The next day. Good morning. I'm back. Okay, I'll be right there. That's my child calling me. But yesterday was kind of like a flop, you guys, because I was feeling so bad. I cannot even explain to you how much pain I was in. 
Sorry, I had to put y'all in the cabinet again because, of course, it's lunchtime. There we go. So, yes, I was in so much pain, you guys, yesterday. I mean, I'm not completely healed today, but I'm feeling, like, so much better. When I got off of work yesterday, I passed out. Like, literally slept for, like, two and a half hours. And then I woke up in even more pain. So, um, yeah, yesterday was kind of a wash in that we didn't do anything. Um, Dee Dee kind of took care of, like, dinner and everything last night, which we just had leftovers or whatever. But I was down. Like, really, really down. So today, um, like I said, I'm feeling much better. I'm not completely healed, but I'm feeling much better. And so I'm picking up the camera to kind of piggyback off of yesterday. So everything I said yesterday, we're going to try to do today, which was um, decorate the upstairs tree, get it get it up and get it decorated. And yeah, that's pretty much it. We didn't really, I mean, I really didn't do anything. Anaya and um, Dee Dee ran errands yesterday evening while I slept a little bit. And then when they came home, I got up. And I was just feeling like crap. I can't even explain to you. And I won't go into detail about what it is. But uh, I'm just in a ton of pain. And um, yeah, it sucks. <laughs> so it's lunchtime again. There's people creeping up on me back here. Uh, I'm making today chicken nuggets, tater tots, fruit, and zucchini. So I will show you what we got going on here. Whoa! I wasn't expecting that to fog up the camera. I didn't think I didn't think that through. There we go. So here's our chicken nuggets that I'm making homemade, and I'm making myself like some chicken sliders um, that I'm gonna put on this bread that we had left over. I'm gonna just be using this uh, brioche style. Oops, wrong side. Butter rolls. So. I'm going to be using that to have some chicken sliders. The kids and my wife are going to have chicken nuggets, which I make homemade for them because they're super spoiled and they don't like anything that I buy from the store that's processed, which I guess I'm really not complaining about because it's much healthier for them anyways. And it tastes better. So no complaining. I'm just saying they're a little bit spoiled. They're a little bit spoiled. That's probably how we should be eating anyway. So I'm just talking crap because, like I said, it's really healthier for them than the processed stuff that we buy in the frozen section. But no judgment if you if you buy that stuff because I would like to be buying that stuff except for my family just won't eat it. <laughs> so no judgment here because you do what you got to do. Um, but yeah, we're, we're getting ourselves ready for lunch. I've got down, getting ready to get food plated on them. Kids are washing their hands. And so yeah, I just wanted to open up the vlog, tell y'all kind of why we didn't vlog the rest of the day yesterday is all my fault. I was just feeling like crap. Like I said, I was in so much pain, I can't even describe it. <laughs> I really can't describe it. But my wife can vouch for me that like I literally was in so much pain. I'm feeling better today. I'm really ready, ready for it to be completely healed so I can like be my 100% self. But it's okay because at least I don't feel like I felt yesterday. So... Hopefully today we can get some stuff done, i.e. the tree, again. And then, um, yeah, that's pretty much all we have planned for today. Oh, and I have to do Anaya's hair, so maybe we'll get some footage of wash day. Um, so I'm going to be washing her hair and giving her a little protective style. She's been in braids for a couple of weeks, and before that she's had like a lot of braid styles. So I think I'm going to give a, give her a break from the beads and the rubber bands to give her hair a break, I should say. So I think I'm just going to do like a little twist out or something. But we shall see. We're going to eat our lunch and we will talk to you later. Later. We're back. The day is done. It's 3 o'clock. Yes, love. You did? She's running to the mailbox. So the boys are leaving because they just come over and hang out with us for homeschool purposes. And so they're headed out, and oh my goodness, and Anaya went and checked the mail. So I'm standing out here watching her, because even though we live in a fairly safe neighborhood, sometimes people are being super weird and creepy, so I like to make sure I stand here and watch her, just to make sure nobody takes my baby. Look, give me a perfume, And she's obsessed with the perfume that comes in the magazines, y'all. So she's so hyped. You know the little samples that come on the pages? She like lives for those. What? I 
Are you bringing me bills as well? Write it to something. Or junk mail. I don't mail. know. It's a big card. It looks like junk mail. Here. Put it. No, put all that mail on top of here. Okay, thank you. Whoa. Mostly junk mail, y'all. Nothing important. Bye! Alright, so... Oh! I'm dropping stuff. Can you grab that for me? Ma. Please, darling. Uh, again. Yeah. Okay, <clears throat> so... We're not doing much. Dee Dee still has another hour worth of work to do. Anaya has homework to do. And I'm going to sit down and take me like a quick 10 minute break before I start doing. What? You got an hour. You got, you got 57 minutes to be exact. And I am going to try to take a small break while helping with homework. And so it's not really a break, you know? But I'm going to try. Take a break, and then we have some stuff I need to do for the house. I definitely need to go to the dollar store because I need to get something for our art project that we're going to do tomorrow. And yes, I'm also waiting on a Target order to be delivered. So you don't get to go to the dollar store. Said, nope. They said um, it should come between 4 and 5 o'clock, so I ordered a bunch of stuff. Just trying to... I wish I could order have Dollar Tree delivered, to be honest. You know, with this new strain going around, I'm trying to stay out of the stores as much as possible if it's not necessary but dollar tree does not have a delivery service so <clears throat> i have to go pick it up and then girl this ain't an invitation so they want you to buy tickets to come watch this show oh yeah so yeah that's what we're doing i'm gonna be throwing away almost everything she just pulled out the mailbox because it's mostly junk mail She's looking for perfume. She's looking samples. for perfume in the mail. I mean, in the magazine, of course. Of course. You need to go ahead and get started on your homework so that you have time to decorate the tree. Because you're going to be one sad little puppy if you got to go to bed. Right? Well, then you better get busy, Mama. Well, if it's easy, then it shouldn't take you very long, right? It's just money. All right, well, get it done then, just money. And you got to read, right? Yeah. Okay. So you need to get it together, and you got a spelling test tomorrow that you need to study for, right? So we got, you got enough work to keep you busy. All right, so this little Pina is going to get busy on her homework. And I'm going to get busy doing... Actually, I'm going to go in here and do bills, I think, on the computer. I'm going to pay some bills, wait for my target order, try to take me a five or ten minute little break. I might have me a cup of coffee. I don't know. I'm getting crazy here, right? And then, yeah, we'll catch y'all later, either when I go to Dollar Tree or when I come back to decorate the tree. I'm not sure. I'm trying to remember to pick up this camera, y'all. I'm doing the best I can. So, I will talk to y'all later. Two hours later. It says Aaron started working on our All right. It's about that time, y'all. It's hair washing time. <laughs> hair washing time. <laughs> Look at my hair. This is what the fluff bunny is looking like right now. Like a wild child. <laughs> and baby, it needs to be washed. Come on, lay back. But she actually likes to get her hair washed, so this isn't too much of a chore. Okay. I have to put y'all over that way. What's up, y'all? Get my hair washed. I How did I become the designated camera person? I'm still trying to see. I don't know. They just throw me in there.
The hair washing is done. Now for the fun part. <laughs> now I have to detangle and style all that hair. Go upstairs and, and get the detangler and everything you need, please. You don't know what light you're turning on? I'm like, what is she doing back there? Like, she don't live here. Okay. So now we're going to, like I said, detangle, put it in a protective style. And then we are waiting on... Okay, so this is going to sound a little bit ridiculous. But I needed some paper plates. I told you I was going to go to Dollar Tree. That didn't happen. I didn't feel like going. Um, and so my wife was kind enough to order some paper plates from a grocery store however she had to have an order minimum so we had to order all this stuff so we decided to order a rotisserie chicken for dinner and that's what we're waiting on so we can eat but while we're eating i'm gonna go ahead and detangle and start styling and then when the food gets ready we can stop if we need to because we still got to decorate the tree and it's like 20 minutes to seven so we'll see we'll see that's how real my laziness is thank god for delivery services huh especially in the middle of a pandemic um but no it's it proves to be very helpful sometimes especially when you just are just being lazy you know just doesn't feel Whoa, like going out her grease is mixed it is the name that she got the wrong one but i think it's mixed the only one that went up there was a mixed one i thought dd mixes our hair grease for us help our hair be healthy and strong and growing and flowing <laughs> so yeah that's what we about to do your fair your fair hair yeah so we're probably just gonna put on a christmas movie and tangle some hair wait for our food and then yeah then we will catch y'all later i guess i'm a, um do something really simple and easy so it shouldn't take me too long to get it done. Why are you, why are you running? Oh. Okay, let me get started on this hair, y'all. It's almost midnight. It's several hours later. I finished Anaya's hair, which I will let y'all see in tomorrow's video because I had to put these flexi rods on the ends and, you know, moose down. So I'll show y'all the finished product tomorrow. But I'm coming to wrap up this video because we are pretty much done for the night. Time goes so fast between the time that the day ends as far as school and work and the time when, like, Anaya has to be in bed. Like, the time goes so fast i can't even explain but if you're a parent then you already know it's not enough hours in the day like so we didn't get the christmas tree up again no. but i will attempt to do that tomorrow tomorrow is uh our family night our regular pizza night so maybe we'll do pizza and decorating the tree what do you think a nice head bob back there yeah. so yeah we'll try it again tomorrow y'all just hang in there to get up <laughs> With Christmas a week and a half to two weeks away. Which I'm gonna... surprised because she usually has the tree up. The house is fully decorated. Like this yeah. is the first year that I get to see her kind of relax with it. And I can't say that I'm not happy about it either. I'm not happy about it. She might be happy about it. But <laughs> I need to get a little more in the Christmas spirit. I think I said that in the video yesterday or, yesterday or the day before. But like I need some more Christmas, you know. It's coming too fast. I haven't got to enjoy the all the emotion and the nostalgia and you know all of the things but anyway i'm gonna have me a little cereal snack mm -hmm. some dry cereal we're gonna finish up our christmas movie and we're probably gonna doze off just like that hope y'all had a wonderful day a smooth and easy night 
We love y'all. Hang in there with us for Vlogmas. And we'll see y'all tomorrow. Bye. Let's go outside. The snow is falling down. And every child is having so much fun. The snowman is twice the size as me. With a smile as quirky as mine. We're holding hands to keep each other.